So I'm I'm using right now the uh, I'm using right now the Jex Teles, uh buzz tone, based off the Selmer buzz tone, which is like a highly sought after pedal based off a highly sought after amp, which was used by um, Sid Barrett for Pipers at the Gates of Dawn, that famous uh, 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 Pink Floyd record. Yeah, it, but the the modification from the summer buzz buzz tone or the, you know from the uh, amp or uh, modification from the pedal uh, that was around for so long that this Jex Teles pedal has it has RCA spaghetti logo silver can germanium transistors inside uh, set on purpose to be higher gain than the original buzz tone amp or pedal uh, that subsequently came out after the amp was uh, discontinued. And uh, this is the Jextalize version, and Jextalize makes a standard buzz tone, and this is the high gain buzz tone. Uh, only about 20 were made, and praise the Lord, I have one of them. <laughs> and I'm going to play for you a little ditty, a little song uh, I wrote. Uh, perhaps I'll call it Corum Jordan, you know, before, before the face of the Jordan, you know, uh, uh, what's his name? Uh, uh, Moses the Patriarch. Um, he attributed God's miracles to his own power instead of giving glory to God. Even though the Bible says that Moses was the, the humblest man on earth, sadly, uh, at the end of his life, he lived uh, 120 years. Uh, his eyes never dimmed. His strength never uh, abated. But um, his pride did grow, um, uh, and pride is the original sin uh, that Satan committed. And, and, um, and, and sad to say, Moses committed it too. Um, you know, I, I heard a great analogy. Uh, even even the sun has spots. If you look through a telescope uh, with the right filtering, um, dark spots. But you would never know it because, well, you go outside and look at the sun. It, it's bright and will blind you. Uh, the point is, um, uh, uh, Moses was a man that, f that saw God face to face. And even Moses had, had his foibles. And that is in part in the Bible put there to remind us that uh, don't do hero worship. Don't, you know, Mariology, whatever it's called, you know, uh, people, you know, the, the papists, uh, the Pontifex Maximus uh, uh, cult, uh, them that there, uh, I'll put with a little c, Catholics like to worship people instead of God himself. And, and right there in the Bible, in, in Deuteronomy, I believe, um, 34, uh, the death of Moses, a, a great man, uh, uh, to be admired uh, sinned against God and God put him down a and so that people wouldn't do um, uh, you know uh, idolatry of a man God hid where he buried Moses um, but th th this this song I also reference Samson you know Samson's prayer uh, I, I, or, or uh, Jacob turned to Israel you know Jacob wrestled with God and God blessed him but then God put a little a little, uh, you know, thorn in the flesh before Paul had his, you know, to, to humble him. Uh, but then Samson prayed to God, you know, between those two pillars, you know, take me out. You know, if I can't live the life that I ought to have lived, uh, uh, let me die here. Uh, or, or even um, uh, you can look to uh, make straight my paths, Lord, I think of uh, 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 Proverbs. So, so many, I pulled so many things from the Bible. Uh, oh, uh, Abraham's only. Uh, Abraham had two sons, Isaac and Ishmael. First Ishmael, then Isaac. But then when God said, uh, sacrifice your son, your only son, he had two sons at the time, but Abraham knew what he meant when he said your only, you know, in effect your only, the one that you really love. Um, and uh, so I sort of have a similar um, reference there, <laughs> we'll just say. Uh, anyways, this is very steeped in scripture, this little ditty here. I'm playing on this Jextlez buzz tone, high gain setting with the uh, 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 RCA spaghetti logo, logo, silver can, germanium transistors inside. I believe three of them are inside there. And I'm, I'm, I've got my guitar into the Jextalez buzz tone into this 1981 Panasonic boombox. <laughs> I know how unusual to play, you know, a cheap guitar into an amazing pedal into a cheap boombox. And then why is it, what, what, speaking of boxes, what, what's this box right here? This is a 1958 Twin Pines Dairy from Detroit. Uh, zinc oxide milk crate and I, I noticed that if I shouted because I, I have it here um, on, a, on a shelf I, I noticed across the room it would resonate you know you talk about resonating frequencies uh, in nature 
and, and I'm like, what would it sound like if I put that little boom box and it fits in there if I put it, you know, at a, at a bias diagonally. And um, I think it gets an interesting sound. I'm, I'm trying, well, I'll, I guess I'll hear when I uh, listen back later, but I, I think it gets an interesting sound with these mics kind of picking up those reverberations as opposed to just kind of letting it, you know, like any speaker, just shoot out against a room <laughs> or the walls. So here's a little ditty I wrote. I know God is able, I pray God is willing, you have the power, please have the will. My heart is broken, I pray it is open, Jesus please heal me, grace overfill. Abraham's only is making me lonely, Father please bless me or let me be killed. I was so foolish when you gave me pure bliss. I don't need a witness, my deeds are all filled. Please sanctify me, I know I defy the life that you gave me to follow my will. Make straight my path, Lord, open a new door. Mountains for Moses upon me be spilled. So I'm going to go from this. I've been in a nine volt position this whole time. I go from nine to three. Now I'm on the three, sort of like they call the saggy, the saggy sound, uh, uh, sort of underpowered, you know, supposed to be uh, 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 full at nine, the, the, the happy compromise at six, but three is that sagging sound, which I, I sort of like for this ditty right here. saggy three volt setting which i also love i love the nine i love the nine volt setting i love the nine volt setting on the jextles high gain buzz tone pedal uh for chords it's just it rips you know but i love the three volt setting on the jextles high gain buzz tone for individual notes um because it kind of like it it, it puts more character into each single note. I, I don't know anything about the technical side of this. Uh, so so for me to try to describe it, I'd probably get myself in trouble and say something that's not even true. Cause like, I, I, I want to say like, there's more tone saturated into each note when it's on the three volt. I, I might be wrong, but there's just, there's just more, more character for individual, I find, for individual notes when I have it on that middle, that three volt setting. The nine volt, like I said, for chords, the six volt, 
Oh wait, gotta turn my volume up. I mean, I like it too, but like nine volts, like to the T's, you know, it's like it's like all the way up, uh, and great for chords, like like really ripping, really aggressive. Three volt is great for individual notes. Six volt, you know, uh, the w w what I hear other people say about at least the regular buzz tones is a, is a six volt is like that happy medium, is it, sort of like that Goldilocks setting that the um, that the the gentleman Jextelez, um perhaps prefer at least themselves, uh, at least for the uh, the Jextelez bus tone standard pedal. Um, but I haven't mu much as much m messed around with the six volt setting yet. Yet, I, I mean, I've just ha I've only had this pedal for like a month, you know. So it's I've got I've got a lot more a lot more to do with it. Oh, I must mention. I have a rechargeable 230 milliamp hour 9 volt battery inside of here. Uh, Nuon Tech or something like that. Only it cost me like 25. No, no. May, it might have cost me like 15 bucks. 15 to 20 bucks for the the 9 volt pedal I have in here, which I expect this 9 volt is gonna last me a year maybe or longer on one charge. Uh, and, and because I hear a lot of these, a lot of Jexless pedals sound better with a, a, a battery inside, so you don't get that. Um, again, I don't know the technical side of things, so you don't get that hum, um, from having a wall wart plug, even like a one spot, like a, your nicest plug plugged in there. It's still going to have some sort of a hum because, um, that's how electricity works. I don't know. <laughs> uh, ask someone else's question, but just anecdotally, I find that the nine volt is like the primo way of doing things with a uh, Jexilis pedals. So I have every one of my Jexilis pedal has like one of those 15, $20, uh, uh, 230 milliamp hour uh, 9 volt rechargeable batteries inside. It may, may I mention rechargeable, meaning so I can keep reusing that uh, 9 volt battery. I love it. I love it. The potentiometer on my uh, Git Fiddle, my cheap Git Fiddle, is uh, wonky. So it's. Uh, so forgive the uh, uh, errors, equipment errors on my part. This Jack Sles pedal is a beaut. Don't blame it. <laughs> I was using a, uh, a a mummy, a V pick mummy pick this whole time. Uh, let me just say now that I'm in silence with the uh, that my my uh, 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 1981 Panasonic boombox turned off. That's what I've been playing into this whole time. You might have a much nicer, you probably, in all likelihood, have a, have a much nicer amplifier than I do. I'm playing through a boombox, people out there. Fellas, there are no ladies watching this, to be honest here. Fellas, I can't recommend enough the products of Jex Teles. Um, come Hades or uh, Floodwaters. <laughs> Uh, I I will stick by this this uh, pedal brand. Uh, they they just make the top quality stuff, um, and and I hope I hope I, I can continue to get more Jextelez pedals in the future. If you there watching at home, uh, for some dumb reason have have two things going on: one, you're incredibly rich, and two, you're incredibly dumb. Uh, rich meaning you can afford Jextelez pedals, and dumb meaning for some reason you want to buy them and give them to me instead of keep them for yourself. I am all on board for that because I, I, there are nine standard as, as, uh, as it says on their Tumblr page, there are nine standard Jextelez models and, uh, I don't have all nine yet. And I would love to play the, uh, just from memory, the, the black drone wasp. I would love to play the, um, the unit drive. Uh, what else do I not have? Um, uh, the Jext face, the Jext Fox, um, so many Jexless, th those four, and then uh, of course the, the 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 white pedal version three. I'm I'm hoping to get in a, in a couple of months. Um, yeah, I just I adore I adore the works of Jexless. I dude, the let me just say the Dizzy Tone pedal. I I I, I you know it's funny when I when I got the Canon Climber two, I compared it to the Dizzy Tone. Uh, you know, similar but different. <laughs> I know, stupid thing to say. You know, what does that even mean? Uh, and but I, I have the same thing to say about the Jexless Buzz Tone. I compare it to the Dizzy Tone, but boy, this this high gain Buzz Tone. Oh, ho, what a different beast! I mean, you could tell it's higher gain than than even the the the, the Dizzy Tone. 
Uh, I almost said busy tone. <laughs> maybe that maybe that will be another juxtaposed pedal in the future. The busy tone. <laughs> no, but I, I this is its own beast. Oh boy, is this so nice. Um, and uh, I always come. I always seem to compare them to the the dizzy tone because it's it's such like a pure sort of uh, distorted sound. The dizzy tone, so it it almost kind of sounds like similar to the other ones, just like I said, a pure version. But boy, this has character. I mean. This this could be your whole style. This pedal right here, the 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 buzz tone. I mean, th this could be your everything. Your 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 single pedal. I, I put two. You know, you have a tuner and your your your, uh, your fuzz. But your your single uh, effect tone pedal on on your board. I I love this pedal to death. I can't recommend it enough. Get it. Get it. Get it. Excellent. Oh wait, no, you can't get it. <laughs> oh no, I'm sorry. <laughs> there are only twenty made. Uh. Hope it comes up on the used market for some, you know, probably someone passing away and, and their, you know, heirs don't know how good it is. And so they put it up for sale. But then by that point, it's going to be scooped up by some money bags person for what price it'll go for at that point. Oh, boy, this pedal is splendid, fantastic. I'm sorry you don't have it. You probably don't have it. If you have it, you already know how amazing it sounds. So you watching this is just sort of like confirming the the truth that is already known to you uh and i suppose for those of you who don't have it i'm so sorry that you don't have it it's such a nice pedal <laughs> get yourself the the uh Jexlez buzz tone standard though won't be as high gain as this I, to be honest i haven't played obviously i haven't played through it yet uh the standard version if you if you have one and you want to send it to me to have to keep oh man or any Jexlez pedal please do but um this is a splendid, splendid, splendiferous pedal, uh, uh, and I can't recommend it enough, but sorry to say, <laughs> you, uh, um, good providence finding it, because, uh, uh, yeah, it's, it will, I, I won't expect to see that on the used market anytime soon. <laughs> it is just too nice to, uh, for anyone to, uh, let go of. Man, I love this pedal. Well, uh, I, I must extend my, my deep thanks to the, fellas at Jex to Les. You, you, you guys do just bang up work, uh, all the superlatives, you know, but for sake of time, just good, 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 not bad. You know, <laughs> what, what, I mean, come on, you, you hear it yourself. You, you could play this if you can find one of these yourself and, and, and confirm what, what I've already shown you, but just, you know, you're probably a better musician than I am. Anyone watching, I'm not the best. Um, but, but for, for what I can do, Boy, I, I I love this this pedal, e even for what I can't do. <laughs> no matter what I do, it makes it sound uh, interesting, uh, more than interesting. Uh, like character, there's character to this pedal, like that, like the way I don't know, the way it uh, oscillates or there's just there's a, there's a lot to be had. I didn't even like turn the the depth the depth knob. Or, or or the volume, you know, like with the depth knob, it, it'll t kind of take that growl off and actually uh, uh, take a little bit of the um, the volume away. So just like with the dizzy tone, you have to find unity gain probably on your amp itself. And then the cool thing, I'm not sure if anyone's ever mentioned this before, but the cool thing about the volume pedal that is included on a few of the Jexteles pedals, or the, the, the volume potentiometer, the volume knob, uh, by the way, these these two knobs are called Marconi knobs. It's just I'm not joking. This is the same uh, knob that was on the original Marconi radio. The original radio. This is the original radio knob. I mean, they they don't they don't miss anything that the the fellows at Jextiles, uh just the the connection to the past, to the best of the past, um, just their, their sense of taste and style, chef's kiss, uh, par excellence. Um, but no, this this uh, volume pedal or volume potentiometer here on this uh, Jexlez uh, buzz tone pedal. This I've used it. I don't know what anyone else uses it for. Please tell me if you have a different use. I'd love to hear it. I'll dial back the to or the the volume and then turn up the the amp. Maybe turn it up all the way so I'm saturating that amp. You know, if, if I have like my tube amp, which I need to replace the tube. That's why I'm not playing through it today. Um, if I have my tube amp all the way up and saturating that tone, I can dial back the volume and get like that dimed out amp sound at a lower volume um, running through this pedal. Just the, 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 the possibilities are endless uh, with this uh, spaghetti monster here, uh, this uh, RCA spaghetti, um, spaghetti logo uh, amazing pedal here. 
So I, I highly recommend if somehow by some miracle of the good Lord above, by good providence from uh, 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 the, the Lord of hosts, the Father of lights, uh, same phrase in the uh, Old New Testament means the same thing. Uh, every good and perfect gift comes from above. Uh, if you uh, somehow get your hands on one of these, I mean, you can snatch it up. Uh, oh, boy, the, the, the things you can do with this pedal. Uh, you'll, 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 you'll use it for a lifetime, pass it on, and, and then the next generation will find yet more uses for it. Uh, it's just, I know just two knobs and one uh, uh, three-way switch, but it, it's got a lot, a lot of different sounds to be had. And I, I just showed you very minimal sounds. I mean, I can do so much just with one setting, so many different things. Um, yeah, you, you'll enjoy this thing. And I, so I highly rec recommend you getting at least the, the Jextilized Buzz Tone Standard. Um, it won't be as high gain as this, but certainly I'm sure it'll have that same flavor, that same beauty. Ah. Well, thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you have a great New Year's. Uh, at, the, at the time of this recording, it's uh, uh, January 2024, Anno Domini in the Year of Our Lord. Uh, I hope you have a great uh, time, whatever time it is you're watching this, and uh, 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 make great music. Uh, get out there, knock them alive. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Au revoir. Please pray for me. I'll pray for you.